Well, tonight we mourn the loss of two great innovators in our city. First tonight, Bel Ortiz, known as the godmother of mariachi. Ortiz is heavily credited for bringing the sounds of mariachi inside classrooms. Her legacy also striking a mariachi movement globally. Here's Ortiz in 2017. She was one of our people who make San Antonio great. I said, a person is richer when you can speak and sing more language, more than one language. I said, and you know it, you're an educator. Ortiz, also the founder of Mariachi and Campanas de America, during her final days, Ortiz was serenaded by hundreds of her students. She was 90 years old. Also tonight, we honor the life of well-known artist Gilbert Duran. Duran helped make this city colorful, and much of his artwork, as you see here, is located at popular San Antonio spots. Earlier today, we visited with Duran's loved ones. Everything about this artist, his soul. The soul of an artist, Gilbert Duran, leaves a lasting impact. He told me, he told me, I am not a man, I am an artist. Duran, a San Antonio native, was self-taught. Much of his work is across our vibrant city. People leaving across the globe collect his work. He could come up with these ideas that were just amazing. Karen Evans was Duran's love and art rep. She stands in front of a favorite piece located at Ola on South Alamo, a koi fish from Brackenridge Park, a U San Antonio for different landscapes. God gave him this gift and he shared it with everyone. Duran was known for his work of wildlife. Evans says his work was special and magical. His friend for more than two decades, Diego Lopez. So he's left a beautiful legacy, a beautiful mark on San Antonio. They both certainly have. And of course, tonight our thoughts and prayers are with the families of both Duran and Ortiz.